Yes. Is this a recording? Hello my friend, here's Bayan with Bayan Hello. In this video I'm gonna show you how to use a super tape. It's a nice tool, helps a lot. And I'm just gonna show you guys how to put the tape inside and how to use it. How hand this tool is. Okay, here we have a super tape. What is a super tape? A super tape is a dry old tools to use to load the tape on get the tape wet with mud for the dry off of the joint it works very well is fast and efficient and then is a uh, consume a little bit time if you have a medium side job this is good to use it tape it for a few hours and grab the hose with the water and wash it it nice and clean so it pay to do it and is a uh, the tape it get the tape the mud even on the tape and uh, that way you don't have a tape losing up without missing the mud so this is is great yeah the traditional method would be doing by hand would be to load the joint with the mud and put the tape dry tape on top and clean it this one the tape already come wet with the mud and is uh, faster and easier to clean it's a good tool to have usually this one is a uh, most the tapers the the taper who does it time to time the job they have one of this because it is not a uh, it is not very expensive and put ahead with the speed of the job. If you're just doing parts, small parts, you don't need one of this. Just do by hand, less mess, less work. But if you're doing a um, few rooms, a basement, that works very good with this guy. If you use it one time for one basement, it would pay for your money. And after you use it to finish with it, you can resell it. Would be bees. This is a tools that uh, many people look for it okay we cover everything about the super tape we're just gonna show you how to use it now first we open it you guys can see we have uh, this piece right there this one here is a hook to hold this open A few little holes in there. This is how it is. The tape would run through those guys. Okay. This side of the tape, we have a reed. We want the the mud. This side is the side we're gonna get the mud on. So we're gonna put it right there this way so i'm just gonna put it in Just gonna pass it there. So as you can see, goes in, go up, and then we just flip it right over. We close it. I'm just gonna pull it. This part would be inside the bucket of mud, very soft mud. And then when the tape run, you can see the tape running there. 
it is very smooth it just goes through the mud and here we can regulate it to get the right amount of mud that we want this is how we regulate it more or less mud and I can show you guys here again you see This would move You guys can see this one in here The string just comes straight Over here So once we release it this move back once we tighten up this one gonna close like that so once it close I just gonna remove this show you guys once this close once I tighten up this gap getting less and less so if you want less mud you see like that You can see, if you look in there, you can see this part is bent, so just gonna release it, just flicks back, and then the gap would be bigger, and then it would be more mud on the tape. This is a very simple tool, but it's very useful if you're doing a, a bigger job. Yes, uh, here's a regular paper tape, paper fiber tape. Just go inside, around it, go in the mud, and just come out just nice like this one. See the amount of mud, guys? This is a good amount of mud. The benefit of use this so if, it's, uh, if it is on a new construction, it is uh, makes a little bit mess, but make the job much faster. And it's a, uh, can get it taped one floor very fast. And this is a uh, good stuff. It is not very expensive and it's uh, used to clean. It's a uh, tapey mud, soft enough to run, but it's uh, not too soft. We need to leave a little bit uh, consistency for the tape to hold on. A little bit mud on it. For the angle part, for the inside corner, we're gonna make it a little bit, mix a little bit more water, make it a little bit softer. Okay, let's work. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you for your support. And if you have any question, comment, please leave it. And I'm here to answer. I love you guys. Thank you for your support.
and see you soon.